What's up everyone, George Lehman here with MuscleMasochist.com It's been a while since I made a video Two, three months, something like that Last video I made was about my father Father dying Father passed away on my birthday And um I uh, took a little bit of time to myself Hadn't taken a vacation In my entire life Since I started working Took a little bit of time to myself Stopped making videos Focused on some other priorities for a while uh, but a lot of people have been asking me, when are we going to see a video? What's going on? What are you doing? Figured I would give you guys an update. I am back in America. Um, I'm only going to be back here for a month or two. Came back to see my family, my mother, my brother, some friends. Um, but the real reason I came back was, uh, to buy rental properties. Uh, when I was about 21 years old, I started telling my mother, started telling my brother, my, my father, that when I was 25, which I'm 25 now, I was going to be able to be able to retire and move to Asia and just enjoy life. Uh, at the time, it seemed like a hard thing to do, but it could be done. But essentially, I'm at that point now. Um, hopefully, while I'm here, I'll end up getting another three rental properties. They're not expensive. They're, it's not like California. It's not like New York. You can buy a house where I'm from. Uh, you know, seventy thousand, give or take. Maybe it needs a little bit of work, and you fix it up. It's worth even more. Uh, this month, hopefully, I'll buy three of them, around seventy thousand a piece. Uh, maybe put ten thousand into each of them. They'll probably be worth. After having put in eighty, they'll probably be worth ninety to a hundred each. So this month, I'll probably make. 30 or 40,000 or something like that just off of money added to whatever worth I have. Um, around a year ago, uh, maybe two years, I don't really remember, I started wanting to get into buying properties because I finally had the money to do it. Uh, online coaching is a pretty lucrative business if uh, you get people good results and offer, offer help for the right price, which I do. Um, I work with people for like 200 for three months. Almost everyone could afford it. That resulted in me making upwards of 20000 a month uh, from online coaching while having very, very little expenses. Uh, very, very cheap house. Owned my car. Cooked for myself. Went to the gym. Didn't do a lot of fun stuff. Didn't really go out and party or anything like that. So I was able to buy, you know, I was able to invest some. And recently, the, uh, the, the properties around where I live have gone up about a third in the last however many months, they've, they've drastically went up in value, and they'll probably keep going up. Um, when my father passed, obviously my father passed, as I mentioned, um, he left some money to, or investments, I should say, to me, my mother, my brother, and uh, that gave me the last little bit of freedom I needed to live this, the kind of life I wanted to live. Um, I didn't exactly have to work before I didn't exactly have to do anything because I made you know enough money to live in Asia from rental properties and you know passive income but now uh, once everything is said and done I should be able to make a few hundred dollars a day without doing anything uh, which should basically allow me to do whatever I want with my life and um, having traveled outside the country having seen how fucking incredible it is in other places I decided what I wanted to do with my life is travel. Um, so what you guys will be seeing is some traveling videos. Um, you guys will be seeing me go to Thailand, Vietnam, Nepal, hopefully. Uh, hopefully I'll get all over the place. I'm going back to Cambodia hopefully in the next month or so. Um, still training. Um, I'm a lot leaner now. Um, focusing on dieting down, focusing on bodybuilding a little bit more. Uh, I was doing sprints in Cambodia on the beach uh, around a month or so ago and I ended up tearing my hamstring running too fast, slowed down on my ankle, <laughs> sprained my ankle, so I tore my hamstring and sprained my ankle at the same time. Um, so that kind of put leg training out of the mix of things for the moment. Got a big old bruise on my ankle, got a big old bruise on my hamstring. Finally just about gone. Um, but uh, Training's been going quite well. I'm pretty happy with training. Getting a little bit bigger, getting a little bit leaner every day. Um, still gonna be making videos. I've just been too focused on um, 
putting together rental properties, forming LLCs, dealing with you know property management companies, that kind of thing. Um, taking care of my life, setting my life up so that in the future I don't have to do anything. But obviously, I will continue to work because I like my work. Um, thanks to my father um, leaving me a couple of different forms of money, thanks to investments, thanks to saving money, thanks to YouTube and you guys working with me to help reach your goals. Technically now, I'm a millionaire, technically. I know some people are going, no you're not, well, I don't, maybe not, I don't know what the definition of it is. Um, I don't have a million dollars in cash, I'll tell you that, but if you count properties and stocks and bonds and all that kind of shit. So essentially I don't have to work anymore. Um, I can do whatever the fuck I want with my life, which is what I've been planning for the last four years. Um, might have taken me slightly longer to live the quality of life I wanted to live, but it ended up working out like this. Um, I'd like to go outside the country, start a gym or start a restaurant or start a bar, just something to make me happy, not even necessarily to make money. It's so cheap to do, it's so cheap to start a business. Over there, you know, uh, a few thousand dollars to start, 1500 a month to run, including employees to work at the business. So I'll probably try and open up a gym or something like that. But the first thing on the agenda is travel. I would like to see the world, um, obviously while training, obviously while being big and strong and shit, but I'm going to get to see the world on my terms without having a boss. I've never actually had a regular job. I've never actually worked at Domino's. I've never worked at Subway. I've never worked at a gas station or something like that. I've always worked for myself. So I'm finally able to not even work for myself. Now other things work for me and I just can sit back and enjoy life the way I want to. So hopefully you guys will like the content. Um, it's pretty crazy. It's a pretty incredible thing. I grew up being obese, suicidal, basically no education, failure in school, failure with girl, failure with friends, and now, now I get to live a life that I never even imagined. I get to live a life that I never even thought was possible. Um, fortunately, in the past, in the recent year or two, I was smart enough to get into rental properties when they were cheap. I was smart enough to get a hold of a couple homes when they were cheap. And um, now they're worth drastically more money. They're making me money every month. They're going to be making me more money as I buy more, going up in value over time. Everything's skyrocketing where I'm from. Wouldn't be surprised in the next year if properties, every property went up ten or twenty thousand dollars. To be honest with you. But that's, I'm, I'm not buying and flipping houses. I'm, I'm looking for passive income. I'm looking for something that'll stick with me my whole life. Allow me not to stress anymore. Allow me to live how I want. Allow me to have a family with kids that I can take care of. And that's my plan. I'm gonna live, uh, this was not my dream to begin with. I wanted to move to Asia, but I didn't, I never dreamed so big. I never knew how, how much I could have. It never crossed my mind that I could go somewhere and have a business, that I wouldn't have to work. I could have a beautiful small girlfriend or have a driver, have a cook, have a housekeeper. It's never occurred to me, but I can do that now because in Asia it's, it's super affordable to do that. You can hire someone to work for you, almost nothing, and they're still making a lot more money than they would if they worked for anyone else over there. So that's, that's what I've been doing lately. Um, it's surreal. It's surreal to think what my life has turned into from where it started. So many points in my life I wanted to die, at so many points in my life I didn't think things were worth living for. Um, I pictured myself working at McDonald's till the day I died, living with my parents, and it just so turned out that at 25 years old I'm set for the rest of my life in passive income and still making money online. Um, to anyone who doesn't think that life is going to be something for them, to anyone who doesn't think that life can be good for them, don't give up. Just think it through. Make plans. Learn. Research. Don't judge yourself so negatively. If other people can be successful, so can you. It might take you longer than some other people. You might not have the same opportunities, but so can you. You can think you're ugly. You can think you're obese. You can think you'll never be lean. You can think you'll never be strong. You can think you'll never have a girl. You can think you'll never have a good job. You can think you'll never be able to retire. I thought all those same things. My life was a fucking mess. At some point in the last year, I didn't want to go on at all. The only reason I'm still alive is because I had a mother and a father and a brother that it wouldn't be fair to leave. Um, 
And I lived my life in a way, I lived my life chasing 900,000 pound deadlifts, not caring about my health at all, at all. I figured, you know, if I die at 30, at least I'll have some rental properties that I can give to my girlfriend. We can take care of her and she won't, she won't need to worry. She won't have to date some piece of shit that won't take care of her, won't treat her right. She can live life on her terms. But I became single and uh, now I'm here. Now I'm here able to travel the world and do exactly what I want with my life. I don't even know how to describe it. I don't know how to put it into words. Um, one of the luckiest people alive, I'm sure. One of the luckiest people alive. Um, I will be putting out more content. I plan to um, hopefully get someone to video and edit for me so more content will come out, it will be better. Hopefully you guys will like the travel videos because I'm gonna do a lot of it. Hopefully you guys will like the cooking videos, whatever it is I make videos of, hopefully you guys will enjoy them. Um, I do plan on making some videos about, you know, not that I'm like a financial expert by any means, but more than some. And I've always been about helping people in the ways that I can. So if I can hopefully motivate someone to live their dreams, hopefully motivate someone to get out of the, the work week, I will. And I'll give you guys the advice that I can on it. Um, what can I say? Uh, life is better than I ever thought it could be. And I'm not just saying that I never thought it could be like this. It just never occurred to me that it could be like this. Um, at this point, I get to live life on my own terms, how I want to live it. If people aren't good for me, I don't have to be around them. I can just do exactly what I want, and that's that's a freedom I've never known. My job is already a good job on the internet. I have a lot of freedom with my job, but now I don't even need my job. I just like my job. Um, really something. Really, uh, really incredible how life turned out. Another beautiful day in Florida. Just enjoying the rain, it's nice and cool. So hopefully you guys will like the videos. Um, I'm gonna try and put out some more for you guys as soon as I get a little bit of extra free time where making a video is a more valuable use of my time than what I've been doing. We're just trying to get as much as I can done every day in the form of figuring out, you know, Taxes, business, all that kind of stuff. Um, but I just wanted to give everyone an update on what's going on. Uh, everything's going amazing. Um, I don't want to say it's like a before and after like success story, but like I'm very happy about it. I'm very happy that uh, I didn't give up on life when I was younger or even last year. I'm very happy I didn't let other people bring me down and tell me what I can't do. I didn't let people scare me away from investing money when I knew it was a good idea. I didn't let people, people try and keep you down. People try and hurt you badly. They try and rip your soul out. They try and destroy you. And I'm really happy I didn't let that happen because I almost did. I almost did. And if I would have done that, I never would have made it here. And if God is real, he blessed me. He blessed me with letting me accomplish the dreams I had for my life of being the strongest in America, at my lift, at traveling, at finding, you know, amazing women, at having amazing friends, at being free. Free. I'm free in the fucking world. I'm free to do anything. Um, and so I decide I want to be healthier. I want to be healthier. I want to eat right. I want to look good. I want to feel good. I want to sleep right. I want to live a little bit longer than I would have if I you know, weighed 440 pounds and tried to deadlift a thousand. All the credit in the world to the people going through the abuse. If, if your life is where you want it at and you're willing to take the drugs and you're willing to go through the abuse of what it takes to get these records, by all means, more power to you. But I've already, I've already done it. I already know what it feels like. I already know. And it's, it's not for me right now. I don't want to deadlift a thousand pounds. I want to look like I deadlift a thousand pounds and I want to be strong as fuck while doing it. And I want to live a fucking incredible life that I can tell my grandchildren about and I want to share it with you guys and if possible I'd like to bring some of you with me I'd like to I'd like to help you look outside the box and achieve the life that you always wanted to achieve whatever that may be for me it's traveling for me it's food for me it's massages for me it's exotic places it's excitement it's adventure it's it's doing as much as I can with this fucking body and this life and that's what I'm doing now that's how my life is going 
So as always guys, thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for your support. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And check out MuscleMascus.com if you're looking for any help on getting bigger or stronger or leaner or anything like that. Peace. And never let someone push your dreams to the side. Live for them, focus on them, go after them no matter how slow. Because one day, even when you think all is lost, the freaking sun will come up again. And it just might be something you never fucking even imagined. It might be something so good you couldn't even fathom it beforehand.